can't express uh, the pain that uh, uh, that we're all feeling, especially the family. And uh, we're just asking for everyone to lift the family up in their prayers and their thoughts and to uh, respect them. Uh, although uh, this uh, this is definitely public pain, but their, their grief is very personal. We ask that uh, you respect all of that. As far as people in Newark, you know, on your church's website, it says, yeah. you know, this is where Whitney Houston sang Absolutely. when she was a kid. Yeah. Her mom's still a member yeah. of this church. Yeah. What can you tell us about that? Well, uh, obviously her roots uh, grow very deep here. And, uh, and because of that, that makes the pain ever more. Uh, Please shut that. Uh, ever more uh, makes the pain ever more deep for for us and and we're just trying to get ourselves together to prepare to to be whatever we need to be for the family and community at this time How do you um, so what are your feelings tonight well, we were out at dinner when we got the news, and we were all very, you know, upset about it. My great nephew, he took it so hard, he went in the bathroom and cried. You know, he's a little guy, but um, I was telling them about Whitney's roots because I know Whitney back from the days of being on the road with Cool and the Gang and other people, other entertainers. So we all had, you know, similar interests, and. Um, I wanted to bring them down to her church where she started. This is where her roots are, and this is where they should know she started, no matter what else is going to um, be said about her. She was a wonderful singer. They're familiar with her just so much, and um, we're going home to watch one of her best movies, The Preacher's Wife.